start recording. There you go. It's recording now. Hi, I, uh, <laughs> sorry. Hi, uh, um, millionaires, multimillionaires. My name is Ali, and today we're gonna do a quick um, tutorial on uh, Google Console. I do have a couple websites already set up on here. What we're gonna do? We're gonna register uh, with Google Console. So bear with me and follow along. Thanks. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if this is something you're interested in. On this channel, we talk about making money using the internet, um, leveraging the internet using affiliate marketing. Um, if you're interested in that, uh, making money online uh, videos, click the subscribe button. Okay, uh, I'm back. So basically, you, you just got to go to search.google.com and it's going to bring you into your Google console here. Uh, I already have um, a few domains registered in here. All you got to do is just hit add property. When you get to this point, all you have to do is basically type in the um, website. So basically what you want to do, you want to type in your domain here and uh, make sure you get rid of the um, HTTP. If you do put that in there, it'll let you know. Real simple. And next thing you want to do is uh, and by the way, make sure you're uh, selected in the selected domain and uh, basically type in your URL here without the HTTP and without any um, um, front slashes on the end and just hit continue. Verifying property tree works. Okay. Okay, so what we want to do here, guys, we want to take this um, TXT record. This uh, You see the snippet over here for... Um, we want to paste that in the um, DNS configuration for this domain, tree-work.ohio.com. So all you got to do is just click over here, copy that snippet, go into your uh, cPanel. I'm uh, hosting with uh, Namecheap. So just go inside your uh, cPanel, click on um, Zone Editor. You need to come down here and select the right domain, which is the very bottom one here. Hit Manage. And what you want to do, you want to select the TXT record okay and the next thing we're going to do is um okay the next thing you want to do you want to come over here you want to come hit at re add record i already did that i'm sorry i should have done it on camera but i had it pause for a second click on add record this thing pops up over, over here make sure you select text and take this value from over here that we copied we're going to dump that right in here okay we're going to hit paste that record's going to go there and uh, what else we got? Um, what else missing here? Let me see. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, the steps that I did earlier are incorrect steps. I want you to follow what I'm going to do here. Uh, basically, in order for you to connect your uh, Google console, you see that uh, text record over here? You would copy it, and you would go to um, your uh, cPanel. I'm using... Um, Uh, name cheap for hosting and you gotta go to uh, zone editor and you're gonna select the domain that you're you're uh, looking to connect which is the very bottom one here I'm gonna hit manage and I'm gonna select all the text records gonna show me everything I have here I'm gonna go down to the domain that I'm looking for which is that one right here and I'm gonna hit edit and I'm gonna copy I'm gonna paste that I mean control a control V and I'm gonna save that record Okay, you have successfully updated the following txt record uh, dot com well, for uh, treeworks.com tree-works.com. Okay, so that's good. Uh, next thing we want to do here is we want to go back and um, verify it. Okay, so after we um, paste the new um, text record over here and we saved it, we want to go back to um, Google Console and uh, you want to wait about four or five minutes because it takes a while for the DNS to update and all you got to do is just hit the verify button and there you go ownership verified and now you can check the property just click right here okay obviously we have uh, access to all the properties over here the website's still not indexed it's still not indexed yet so you cannot really see much um, property over here but that pretty much um, gives you um, 
a good rundown on what you need to do as far as connecting your Google console to your, um, uh, I'm sorry, verifying, uh, connecting Google console to your website and verifying ownership. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment for more videos.